two long-term problems, too many people, too few trees. Moti Nasani, character, speaker, essayist, theme, unless and until the overpopulation and deforestation a controlled human existence can't be saved for a long time. Summary The essayist Moti Nisani says that the two long-term problems are the problems of overpopulation and deforestation. Now the world's population is increasing rapidly due to nutrition, sanitation and modern medicine. Every year the world's population grows by more than 50 million. More people will need more food. To produce more food, we have to cut down the forests. And there will be no trees. The land, water and air will be polluted. Deforestation will cause landslides, desertification, flooding, soil erosion, droughts, etc. The environment will be destroyed. Different kinds of diseases will increase. The rare animals are declining now and more harmful rays from the sun reach us. Moti Nisani says that the growth rate of the population of Nepal is very dangerous. When Nepal becomes overpopulated the country should face all kinds of problems. So, the future of Nepal is very dark if the population is unchecked. To solve these problems, we have to save forest control population, educate people on population problem and deforestation. Effective family planning, reforestation in the bare areas, efficiency, not wasting anything, in the use of wood products and recycling. Government should make hard law and punish to the rule breaker. Long questions 1. Explain the links between overpopulation and deforestation. Or, discuss the two long-term problems. Overpopulation and deforestation are the two sides of a coin. Deforestation is the main cause of overpopulation. Human population is changeable because every day some people die while other are born. Now, the world population has been increasing more than to the past due to nutrition, sanitation and medicine. Every year the world's population grows by more than 50 80th million. It is a fact that the world is limited and if the population grows unlimited there will be great problems in the world. More people will need more food. To produce more food, we must cut down the forests and there will be no trees. The land, water and air will be polluted. If the populations will increase they need more food. And to grow more food, we must cut down the trees. If we do that, we have to face different kinds of natural calamities. Then, the population will affect badly. In this way, they are linked closely. Short questions 1. How can we save our forests? Or, is there anything you can do to help save Nepal's remaining forests? We can save our forests by controlling the rapid population growth and deforestation. Population can be controlled by effective family planning and population education. We can save the forests using efficiency in wood products and recycling. The government should provide financial support for preserving forests. We should replant the trees. We should use smokeless shulo in our village areas and so on. 2. What is the main theme of the essay? Too long-term problems, too many people, too few trees. The main theme of the essay is unless and until the overpopulation and deforestation a controlled human existence can't be saved for a long time. This essay is about two problems that are going to make people's lives much worse. It is possible they will destroy all life on our planet. These problems are that there are too many people in the world and that our forests are being destroyed. The problems are related because when there are too many people, forests get cut down more quickly and trees do not get replaced. 3. Give three reasons for the disappearance of the forest. People cut down forests for various reasons. Firstly, the population of the world is going up because people are living longer than in the past and too many children are being born. They convert forests into farmlands. This increase in population is causing forests to disappear. 
Secondly, the demand of dairy product is also causing forest land to be changed into grassland for cattle farming. Thirdly, people's demand for wood and paper products is also causing the destruction of forests. And to feed, educate and live luxuriously for the continuously increasing population is only solved by the clearing forest. That's why the forests are disappearing rapidly. 4. How has the balance between the number of deaths and births been disturbed? Human populations have always been changing. It is because every day some people die while others are born. The number of births is slightly higher than the number of deaths. With advances in nutrition, sanitation and health, people live longer. Very few people are ill. Therefore, the growth of population and balance between the number of deaths and births has been significantly disturbed. 5. What leads Moti Nasani to the belief that the world is facing an overpopulation problem? There are many reasons that lead Moti Nasani to the belief that the world is facing an overpopulation problem. Among them, one of the belief is in effective family planning and modern medicine advance in nutrition, sanitation etc. These reasons make people live longer and increase rapidly but the area of earth remains always same. And it creates problems in price rise and spread more of the harmful viruses. 6. What are the main points that the essay raised up? The important ideas or main points that the essay raised up are overpopulation, deforestation, pollution, climate change, family planning. Overpopulation is the problem of having too many people in an area. Deforestation is the act of cutting down or burning the trees in an area. Pollution is the process of making air, water, soil, etc. Dirty. Climate changes are changes in weather for example some areas of the world are getting hotter. Family planning is the process of controlling the number of children you have by using contraceptives. It is a method of preventing pregnancy. 7. Why is the disappearance of forests harmful? Deforestation, which is known as disappearance of forest will cause landslides, desertification, flooding, soil erosion, droughts etc. The environment will be destroyed. All kind of pollution spread different kinds of diseases. The rare animals are extinct from the earth and more harmful rays from the sun reach us. Then ozone layer depletion torches us dangerously. Every year many people died from floods and droughts. That's why disappearance of the forest is very harmful for human beings.